Aqua Refining, the next wave in lead recycling. Lead is the most recycled commodity on Earth and is the most sustainable choice for energy storage. The lead battery market continues to thrive, driven by significant growth in market sectors such as data centers, automobiles, e-bikes and grid storage. These key drivers are part of the reason the lead battery market was forecasted to grow by 35 billion between 2015 and 2025. Lead is a finite resource, and with roughly 70 to 85 percent of all new lead batteries utilizing recycled lead, the lead recycling industry will be challenged to meet demand especially with the environmental restrictions continuing to tighten across the globe. To meet this challenge, the lead recycling industry will need an alternative recycling method that does not have permitting challenges. Traditional lead recycling is a high heat and high emission process. Introducing Aqua Refining. Aqua refining uses an aqueous-based electrolytic process to plate lead at room temperature. It does not generate the emissions or the permitting challenges that face smelting operations. This patented process builds lead one atom at a time, which results in a highly pure product. Aqua refined lead is the new gold standard for the industry and is currently being produced at 99.997% pure lead. With technology enhancements, it's expected to produce the purest lead on Earth at 99.999% by 2020. The Aqua Metals Recycling Facility in McCarran, Nevada is a full-sized commercial production facility where proof of concept has been demonstrated and it is now being scaled to full-sized production. With the technology proven, Aqua Metals is now proceeding to phase two of its business model, licensing the aqua refining technology to recycling facilities across the globe. As environmental restrictions tighten, traditional recycling facilities have three options in leveraging aqua refining technology. The first is to install aqua refining as a way to increase their lead output without increasing furnace usage and emissions. The second is to keep total production the same while reducing emissions through the use of aqua refining enabling recycling facilities to meet tightening environmental restrictions without lowering total production of lead. And the third option is to build greenfield aqua refining facilities co-located with battery manufacturing facilities for improved logistics. In conclusion, these key drivers are part of the reason the lead battery market was forecasted to grow by 35 billion between 2015 and 2025. Environmental regulations are tightening. The industry needs cleaner recycling methods. Aqua refining meets the demands of a growing industry in a tightening environmental landscape while delivering a superior product.